So guys, thank you for joining me tonight. I appreciate it. Uh, fact, the first question will be, what's your name, how old are you, and where are you from? Uh, Raiden, and I'm seven and a half, and uh, Carrington. Yeah. I'm Chad Christensen, Raiden's dad. I'm 36 years old, and I'm also from Carrington. No. Do you guys still watch wrestling on a regular basis? Uh, all the time. Oh, yes, we do. Uh, do you guys watch any certain federations? We have the network. Oh, nice. Well, yeah, we watch uh, WWE SmackDown Raw, okay. and then uh, NXT stuff, and all the pay-per-views, because we do have the network. Okay. And I also occasionally watch New Japan, okay. and they have watched a little bit of it with me. But Only when Chris Jericho was on it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've heard good things. I've never actually got to see it yet, but I've heard, I've heard it's pretty oh. awesome. Okay, what first got you into professional wrestling? Uh, my brother and my dad. Mm -hmm. Like watching it all the time. Good, good. Yeah, good. I, as long as I can remember, I've always liked it. Mm -hmm. And I, I have a picture that of myself when I was even younger than him, probably three, four years old. And there's a little old AWA wrestling ring and figures. Oh, oh, so I mean, as far as I can remember, I've. That's classic. No, I started in the lesson when I was three. Yeah, really? You were three, too. You were about okay. the same age. That's even further back than I go. That's awesome. All right. What's your favorite hey. wrestling move? Hey, John Cena. Hey, John Cena, all right. Hey. Mine would probably be... An old school one would be like Ric Flair for your four type thing. Yeah. I just love that. And yeah. probably one of the newer, newer one would be... Uh, CM Punk GTS. This would be excellent. CM Punk fan, I like it. Alright. Who is your favorite male and female wrestler if you have females? Who's your favorite? What's your favorite boy wrestler and girl wrestler? John Cena is the boy. Okay. Sh Shasha Bakes is the girl. The boss, alright. Nice. Mine would, is. My favorite female wrestler is probably Charlotte Flair, actually. I, I think she's awesome. And for male, it's, it's goes back to when I was younger. It's really hard for me because it's always between Macho Man and Hulk Hogan because those were just, you know, 80. And then, and then when I was older, they added to it after there and end the wheel stuff for me. I like all those guys too. It's so hard for me to pick right now. Sting, Wolfpack, all that stuff. DX. Stone Cold Rock. Okay. Good answers, guys. Good answers. Okay. Is there any superstar that you think is underrated? And that means, do you think he's like he's he should be higher up on the card than he actually is? Like he's better than he gets stuck with. Cesaro. Ooh, good answer. That's a very good answer. I agree with that. One. Are you talking about your current now? Current uh, stars? Anytime. Or? Oh, anytime. I. One guy I always think thinks gets overlooked is uh, Bam Bam Bigelow. Oh wow! Well. Because he was, for how big he was, he oh, was yeah, he could move. He was doing flips off the top rope, and I mean, you know, really good. So, okay. so yeah, he was. He uh, he's one of them. And then now I think it, he's trying to get more of a push now. But I think Finn Balor is yes. very awesome. Yes. So I like the demon when he came back. Like the demon Balor, oh yeah, she's pretty sweet. Okay, if you were a professional wrestler, what would your name be? Hmm. I believe in the crush Yes. I mean, the bad guy. He's got, he's, he's made a couple of his own guys on, like, a video game. Oh, okay. yep. And you can make your own toy wrestler, too. I'm going nice. to do that. Sweet. Yeah, that might be. Yeah, he's got... I have 300 of those figures, so it's... I have more than that. <laughs> that's, a, that's a collection. Yeah, you got a room those. for them? I got a bag for them. That must be a big bag. Okay. Uh, what is your favorite wrestler? Hmm. Like, what is your favorite wrestler? 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 Like, what is
Yeah, that's a good like one. That one. I like burn it down. Burn it down, oh yeah. Well, that's a sweet one. Mine would have to be uh, Real American. Oh, I would love it. Classic. Classic. Really nice. Because I love that stuff. Because your dad and I were around <laughs> for a long, long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> that's a... Uh, what would your finishing maneuver be? And if it would have an end? If it had a name, what would you call it? I already have it. You already have it? What do you have? The Brady team. Oh, I love it. I like going like this and smash my mom's face. Uh -huh. That's me, right? <laughs> <laughs> I like injured my knee when I like smacked my knee. Yeah. I like bruised my knee. <laughs> I gave him a black yeah. eye. When you actually, you actually <laughs> need me in the head. Yeah, that, yeah, that was funny. what I was. That happened. Uh, did Dad take it like a champ, though? No. He, I whined like you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he I complained like a heel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that, that's a great story. Thanks, Dad. Uh, what would be if you could have any two guys? If you have any two guys fight, who would you want to see fight? A yeah, dream match. A dream match. Who would you dream match? Undertaker and AJ Styles. <laughs> yeah. I'd like to see that one. That one could still happen. Yeah. I don't know. Taker's getting kind of old. Yeah, but he's wishing to wait at Super Showdown. Is he? Oh, okay. I, on October 6th. October 6th? I'll have to watch that. I think a dream match. You can be past and present to it for the young. Yeah. I, I would like to see um, Hogan and Ric Flair win back back when they were both when, at the, the prime. So it happened about eight years, yep. ten years too late. Ten, ten years too, yeah. You know, it was so cool, but it would have been cool to see yeah. that when they were, yep. you know, back in like 80s. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep, I totally agree. And I actually, when I was thinking about this last night, because there's so many matches, you know, right. oh, yeah. it's so hard to, right. to pick one. But something right. weird I was thinking about that I think would be, that I'd just like to see for whatever reason would be, I want, I'd like to see Brock Lesnar mm -hmm. versus Scott Steiner in his prime when he could oh, move around and stuff. Oh, yeah. I think that'd be cool. That's, kind of That's two match. big boys. Well, I'm just saying it'd be kind of cool to see. Oh yeah, one guy beat one of Triple H. Didn't he bring a wild tiger once? Oh yeah, like Scott Steiner. Yeah, he did. Oh, well. That was weird. And I actually saw one of the... I was at uh, WrestleMania 25 when it was Undertaker and Shawn Michaels, the first one I was there. And it was one of the cool, one of the best matches of all time. And, and I was actually there, so it was cool. Uh, okay, it's my team. Go ahead. We, get, we might go to WrestleMania two years in a row. Two years in a row? Maybe. Nice. Mm -hmm. I've never been to WrestleMania. It's supposed to be in Minneapolis. I, I get to meet wrestlers, John Cena and stuff. You're going you to meet John Cena or you already met John Cena? I'm going to meet him. You're going to meet him? Nice. I'm a, I get to arm wrestle him. You're going to beat him? You're going to go like this when you're done? Yep. Oh, yeah. I made a video and mocked him. You can't <laughs> see me. <laughs> That's awesome. If I threw up the two sweets, would you two sweet me? Mm. Oh yeah. yeah. Excellent. And if you could, in one word, what would you say? If you could describe wrestling in one word for you, uh, what would it be? Hmm. I'm taking AJ Styles. It's phenomenal. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good answer. That's, that's a really good. I would. I. I just think it's it, awesome, you know, it's just for, just for what it can bring, you know, from an entertainment level mm -hmm. to, you know, the athleticism, the storylines, all that stuff, I think it's, right. it's cool, you know, you might not always like the storyline or this wrestler right. or that wrestler, but it's just, the Still. whole thing is awesome, you know. <coughs> Throw in some. Can I interview with me to see Yeah, no. <laughs> we should have a match. <laughs> The table's gonna be broken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're doing that. Maybe if we get a different table. Yeah, maybe. It'd be kind of hard to break this table. Yeah, I can see you going off the top of one of these. Yeah. <laughs> you can go off the top of this, buddy. I had to jump on it. Lay him out. Probably just hang on the roof. <laughs> and the roof just let her go. Yeah, and the Kind of Jeff Hardy? Yeah. A little bit of a swan tongue? <laughs> yeah, I don't know how much, to, I don't know if you can edit this or whatever, but, yeah. you know, you asked the question, too, about what first got you into it, so liking wrestling. I, I can also remember, I was probably seven years old, maybe right, right around his age now, my dad took me 
to Jamestown Civic Center. Yeah, he saw the Rockers. And it was, it was AWA, it was the Midnight Rockers, Shawn Michaels, Martin Jenny versus a team called Bad Company. I have that, one uh, of those. Was that Eddie and... I have one of those. No, nope, that was, I don't know who Bad Company, I can't okay. remember who they were. I had a Shawn Michaels. Rockers yeah, but it was the original, you know, the Rockers, and then before they, before their WWF yeah. stuff. And I remember Sergeant Slaughter versus uh, Colonel De Beers, and I distinctly remember parts of, parts of it. Mm. Like it was, you know, it was my first time being there and seeing it in person. That was a long time ago. That's when oh, AWA was still traveling that's around. That's cool. I've been like early. Right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you want to hold up your belt? Yep, absolutely, buddy. That's not that heavy. It's heavy. Dead. Just not on the salt. You want to hold it up? Hold up a tent? Yeah. Okay, you can shut it down. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, I appreciate you coming out and doing my interview for me. I'm going to do a couple of two sweets again. Thanks, guys. All right, sweet. Thank you, guys.